the Caribbean Sea, the 17th century. A time of mercenaries who search for new lands when honor and justice have lost their splendor. A new dawn comes, a new leader to liberate the Corsairs from Turtles Island. She looks for three magic objects. She looks for her own destiny, a black rose, a brave and passionate heart, a sword eager for justice. She is coming, the daughter of the Black Corsair. Her name, Yolanda. My shipmates dance till they dropped. So it's time to give them the brush off. It's what they would have wanted. Luckily, our Corsairs of the Black Rose fared better in their last adventure, which was not without its dangers. First of all, the raid itself went plummeting over a waterfall and survived. And then Yolanda and Morgan managed to escape the mysterious island of Paloma Grande with a little help from a gigantic prehistoric bird. <laughs> and they went in search of the island of Tuktakam, hoping to find the green map and the red scepter. Well, we're on our way once again, but I still don't see how we're going to find Tuktakam. But Tuk the Carpenter would have to wait while they put in a turtle island for repair. <laughs> what? Oh, shiver me timbers! It must be high tide already. <laughs> and just look at the scurvy spooks oh, the surf's oh, washed up. Oh, oh, oh. Stole that? We serious business. <laughs> huh? To bring back the black rose. Yeah, but that run ain't for me. It's for them. Me tattoos. <laughs> Then I tells your tattoos to look lively, lad. The Black Rose I is don't believe it! it. Ah! Avast there, you slippery sons of a mangy old sea dog, you! Ah! So those seagoing spooks think they've stolen the Black Rose? Well, they won't have it for very much longer! You're doing well, laddie. You're making a fine pirate with Emilio's help. Steady, Marco. Turtle Island, here we come. Turtle Island, that's my father's home. Yes, you're right, Emilio. Now it's home for all of us. I'm sorry to say this, Carmel, but it's not as grand as Maracaibo. It may not be much now, but in the days of the Black Corsair, Turtle Island was the fairest port on the Spanish main. Justice and honor reigned supreme, and its weather was beyond compare. The bravest ships and boldest Corsairs set sail from these waters for the far corners oh, of the world. Hello. Until our royal governor Van Gold's treachery robbed the island of its ancient glory. Yeah! But all that is about to change! Right? We have a sworn duty, all of us, as Corsairs of the Black Rose, to throw off Van Gould's tyranny and restore the island to its former splendor. And if the 
there's one thing our Turtle Island mateys can still do, it's throw a welcome home party the like of which you've never seen. Ahoy, mates, meet Yolanda, daughter of the Black Corsair. <laughs> Thank you, my friends, for your wonderful welcome. It's great to be home. Hey, you don't suppose Yolanda will let all this attention go to her head, do you? <laughs> How are you doing, Morgan? <laughs> oh, your doll and Patricia's missed you, Morgan. Not as much <laughs> as your Monica. Yeah, but your own dear Angelica loves you most of all. Will you guys get down? No, no, I no, love him no. more. I love him more. No, he Take loves the advice him. of a sea dog with a lass in every port. Take one of those girls and Yolanda will see to it. But... Huh? Yeah. A lass in every port, eh, Carmo? Carmo! Margarita! I'm funny wanting! Let the festivities begin. Eat, drink, and be merry, Corsairs. Wee, oui, wee, oui, drink up, for tomorrow we may be out of air. Uh-huh. Mm. Oh, oh, not today. Long live Yolanda, daughter of the Black Corsair, wherever she is. Oh, said the mansion of the Black Corsair is this way. You're right. One of us should attend the party thrown in our honor to make sure Morgan doesn't make too big a fool of himself. Well, I, uh... uh... <laughs> what? Call yourself French gear. You're using tomato sauce uh, like a barbarian. Store that ignorant bilge. I got this speciality from a Malay pirate. It's called ketchup. I don't care if you call it ketchup. No one could eat it. Hmm? I think that my leg is on fire. It'll taste like yeah. everything else. That is so Carmo? Hey, Carmo, it's Yolanda. Heading for the Black Corsair's mansion. And why shouldn't she? As his daughter, it's hers by right. Tell the ghosts about it. They have haunted that place for many years now. Hmm? An intruder, eh? We knows how to deal with intruders, don't we, Tattoo? Mm -hmm. Do we? Father, I've come home. Meanwhile, Van Gogh and Captain Valera, sure that the Corsairs will come here to repair their damaged vessel, are hoping to capture them and seize the Black Stone in one fell swoop. Helped by Turco pirate John Largo, who has revealed to Governor Van Gogh the secret location of Turtle Island. Oh. Uh, curse my luck, that foul-breathed rum swiller John Largo is upwind again. A man's breath is worse than the foulest vapors. His breath could stop an elephant at 50 paces. Forgive me for suggesting this, sire, but why don't we just let him through? And let that evil-smelling squid lead my expedition. Captain Valera, have you no sense of propriety at all, man? On the other hand, if he sails ahead, I won't have to smell him. Do you see that, me buckles? The governor there has just given us the honor of leading the attack. I can't believe it. My home abandoned. She's already inside. I can hear her. Okay, I'll float down and see what's happening. <laughs> oh, oh. I guess it's about hey. time I went on that ectoplasm free diet. Hey, well, in the meantime, lad, uh, uh, I've got an idea. Uh, no. How uh, you can lose an awful lot of them ugly pounds without any dieting. Oh, I feel better already. <laughs> Be brave, Emilio. We've got to keep your lander safe. And make sure there are no ghosts. Did what? someone mention my name? Bitch, <laughs> get out of here! <laughs> get on down here, Splinter. I got him on the run. Come on. 
Hey, be careful! <laughs> Hurry up and pull yourself together, Tattoo! I think we've got our work cut out for us! Mother... Honorata the Black Rose, oh how I wish you were here with me, Mother. So far and yet so near. And I feel you near me in spirit at least. Uh, hey, what are you? Oh, my father, the Black Corsair, and my uncle's the Red Corsair, and the Green Corsair. Say, now that couldn't be food I smell, or could it? <coughs> Great Neptune's beard! Maybe we imagined that ghost. No spook could prepare a feast like this. Someone must have lived here all these years. <coughs> But, but, McGurk, give me back my Whoa. leg, you drumstick snatch, you. For the first time in my life, I really have lost me appetite. Come on, Emilio, we've got to warn Yolanda! <laughs> <laughs> Shiver me goose pimples, we're the scariest spooks on the Spanish main. Belay the celebration, someone's penetrated the inner sanctum. Oh, Father, it's the doll I gave you for good luck before your last voyage. A letter addressed to me. Dearest Yolanda, I entrust my mansion and all my worldly possessions into your care, including my sword, which was never drawn in an unjust cause. Thank you, Father. I'll try to be worthy of it. No, you don't! Huh? Ah! Now then! Ah! What? Withdraw! Withdraw! Go, you foul intruder! Before you taste cold Ooh. steel. Well, it's uh, uh cold anyway. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. 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 Bye for now. And now it's your turn to say goodbye. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah! Who are you? I'm your worst nightmare. Ha <laughs> ah. You're not even a bad dream. Now what's going on? Oh, I, oh, huh? Now, give me one reason why I shouldn't skewer the pair of you. One reason, and you better make it a really good one. I'll tell you this once and once only. Harm any of my friends with my father's sword, and even death won't be enough to save you. The Black Rose together with the Black Stone? <laughs> what? Well, uh... Well, then I know who you must be. My daughter, Yolanda. <laughs> you, you mean to tell us this is the Black Corsair's daughter? Aye, my daughter, but you must hurry now, Yolanda. The tyrant Van Gould approaches. You must obtain the green map, for that is the key father. to finding the island of Tukta Carbon. I will do my best, Father, I promise, so that justice may be done. Huh? Watch out for ghosts. There is a ship coming in. Sail ahoy! In fact, lots of sails, and they're all flying Van Gould's flag. Hey, Morgan, good to see you. I see that you brought your fan club with you. I what? <laughs> oh, yeah. Look, this is no time for jokes, Yolanda. If we don't close the sea gates, Van Gould will be in our harbor. Annihilate all resistance! Pound the rogues back into the ocean! Carmo, get a gunnery crew out to the Ray now. We've got to return fire. Marco and I will stay here and try and give Morgan's solo act a little backup. Here, Pierre. This is for my sweet Morgan. And mine. And mine, too. Just keep them coming, ladies. This is for Carmo. Stay close behind me, Major. Ah! <laughs> that was close. What are we 
we gonna do now? I wish I knew. One thing's for sure, we'd better get away from here and fast. <laughs> Once I'm in their pretty little harbour, I'll lay waste to them like a barracuda in a goldfish pond. <sighs> Yolanda, what are you doing here? Saving your rear end, Morgan. Well, much as I hate to say it, I owe you one. Forget it, Morgan. We've still got important things to do. Come on! This windlass is what raises the gates. Ah! So push for all you're worth. That's it. Keep on pushing! Ah! 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 Again! Harder! Lago's nearly through! Oh no! Pull back! Just one more push, mate! Ah! Uh, abandon ship! Oh, no! oh, Yay! Yeah, for, for the first of the, the Black Rose! Yeah. Well, we took out Largo's ship. But the Bullion's more than able to pound Turtle Island into rubble. And Margarita's yeah. battery is powerless Fire. to stop them. You know it's a pity we can't do what that ancient Greek fella did and get hold of a giant carved mirror. You know the kind I mean? He used it to turn the sun against his enemies. Maybe we can, Carmo, if you'll just follow me. This, my darling kittens, is how a battle should be fought. I get to pulverize my enemy and they can do nothing. You see, Carlitos, this way the sunlight bounces back and forth, back and forth, getting brighter and brighter, and more importantly, hotter and hotter. Here they come, mates. Right, lads, three points to stop it. Now! What? Shiver me rotting bones if that ain't the devil himself! It works! It really works! <laughs> now for Van Cool. They think they can beat me by using smoke and mirrors? Never, you fools! Do you hear me? Never! Pity we can't get him in closer. Anyone care to go for a little walk? What are we doing taking a boat for a walk? This is crazy! How are we gonna walk across the bottom of the sea when I can't even swim? I'm not saying I got cold feet, but I'm in over my head. There's nothing to worry about, Marco. The air pocket that's trapped inside the boat will keep us alive. We've got enough to be able to breathe. As long as Yolanda doesn't use it all with her talking. If it bothers you, maybe you should have stayed on dry land with your all-female gun battery. Uh, you needn't worry. I'll have plenty of time for them later. Good work, Marco. I knew you could do it. Maybe this underwater stuff ain't so bad after all. Keep firing at them! Pulverize those corsets! Oh, hey, now that what? ain't nice. How did you get here? Us? Oh, we were just out for a little walk. I couldn't agree with you more, my darling kittens. Well, don't just stand there. I order you to eliminate oh. those awesome corsairs. Oh. Guess it's time to get busy. Okay, let's go to it. Uh. I'll take the four mass, you take the main mass. That's it, Morgan! We've done it! Time to set sail. We'll soon have you within range of Carmo's guns. Whatever they are doing, huh? I want it stopped. Do you hear me, Valera? Don't worry, sire. I'll stop them. Look out, Morgan! I'm on my way! So far, so good. What do you think? I think we're gonna bump into Lago's vessel any minute now. Right, 
Carlitos. Reposition the cart. This one's for your lander. <laughs> I think we make quite a team. Morgan! Yolanda! Look out! Ha-ha! <laughs> so we meet again, Corsairs! And just what is it you think you may have accomplished exactly, eh? Oh, nothing much. <laughs> <laughs> what? You dare deface the Royal Governor's flagship? ship is on fire! So do something! Get a kiss the hog too, then. Well, now you'll have to ask my husband to pay. Make that a girl in nearly every port. Now I mustn't be greedy, lad. Share and share alike. Congratulations, matey. It couldn't have happened to a nicer son of a sea dog. But your cologne there sure stinks. But that offensive odor is not coming from me, mon ami. Hey they are! Have at them, lads! We'll crack this turtle wide open yet! <laughs> Ooh, that breath Lago and his stinking shipmates. Oh, Pierre, my sweet, I wonder if you'd care to do the honors for me. Avec plaisir, my own true love. Hmm. Huh? Get out of my way! If we're gonna get out of here alive, now's a good time. Nice of Lago to give us a new yeah. ship. Mmm, this old tub's gonna need a real good scrub. <laughs> Familio, I'll follow Van Gool to the ends of the earth. I will not rest until the green map is once again restored to the Corsairs of the Black Rose. Put your backs into it, me hearties! If we can't catch Van Gool, Maracaibo's our next stop. But if anyone should work up a curse, let me know. We've plenty of grog in these here barrels. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not for much longer, if we have any say in the matter. Just be sure to keep the Black Rose safe. Safe for Miss Yolanda. Ah. Yeah, I'll drink to that. Yeah. Until next time, me hearties, for the Corsairs of the Coast. Ahoy there, Buccaneers. I have a question for you. Can a victory lead to the worst defeat of all? That's what Yolanda and her fellow Corsairs will have to decide when they set sail after the fleeing royal governor in an attempt to reclaim the green map. One of the three keys to the treasure of the Corsairs. It's a double-barreled broadside of an adventure. So fatten your hatches and set your sails for swashbuckling thrills the likes of which you've never seen.